in the beginning. Oh, long before that. When light was deciding who should be in and who should be out of spectrum, yellow was in trouble. Even then. Seems that green, you know how green can be, didn't want yellow in. Some silly primal envy, I suppose, but for whatever cause, the effect was bad on yellow and caused yellow to weep yellow tears for several eternals before there were years, until blue heard what was up between green and yellow and took green aside for a serious talk in which blue pointed out that if yellow and blue were to get together, not that they would, but if they did, a gentle threat, they could make their own green. Oh, said Green with some understanding. Naturally, by a sudden change of hue, Green saw the light and yellow got in. Worked out fine. Yellow got lemons and Green got limes. As an intellectual vibration, smack dab in the middle of spectrum, green can be a problem. That's because there's so many different greens inside of green, and each one has a different IQ. There's the green that should never have happened, the stupid green. The green that is green with envy. Then there's the so-so green. The who cares anyway green. But somewhere in green is a green here and there that has something to say. A truly intelligent green. A green with some integrity. That's the kind of green for you and me. There's a green to be seen with. Vivid, vibrant, living alive. We should spend the better part of our time, yours and mine, with a green like this. Maybe some of it would rub off.